Well, a Bay Area couple is at the end of their rope. After waiting nearly a year, their fire damaged home has yet to be fixed. They say Citizens Insurance isn't paying them the full amount to repair their house properly. And this is just the latest in a number of complaints against the state backed insurer. Ten News reporter Althea Paul spoke to the family about their ordeal, which is not over yet. I don't think we can afford a house. Big Jonathan either. and Mary Ellen Sheldon <laughs> thought they'd be back in their own home by now. It's been extremely frustrating. Um, you just, you know, living life, you have your own challenges, and then you have to deal with this on top of it. It just seems like a burden. Back in January, an electrical fire damaged their St. Petersburg home, where they lived for 15 years. It needs to be gutted. The Sheldons, like many homeowners, have state backed citizens insurance. They got a check in February for just more than $64,000. However, the couple says the repair estimates they received were close to 100000 or more, and they say citizens won't. Don't pay the balance. It's not like they're questioning whether it's a valid claim or anything. So I don't understand what the problem is when we've got multiple quotes that all say, no, it's this much. Rick Tutwiler, a public adjuster who the Sheldons hired, says he's seeing a lot of underpaid and delayed claims. You wouldn't think, having not had any hurricanes in the state of Florida for six years now, but what insurance companies are able to do is, is, is what we found is kind of pick these claims apart. A spokeswoman with Citizens said they have continued to work with the Sheldons and have made significant payments. She adds they have been very responsive with the claim, want to resolve the issues, and would accept and review any other documents and information the couple has. The Sheldons and their three children have been living with Mary Ellen's mother. They've hired a lawyer to get the money to fully fix their house. In the meantime, all they can do is wait. Not just going to get up, get dressed, go to work, come home, hopefully hear something good news back. Now, the Sheldons say that their lawyer has filed a suit for breach of contract. They're hoping to get about 117000 what their adjuster has estimated for the repairs. Meantime, they are still paying their insurance premium and mortgage on that house. Melanie. Wow, Thea, very frustrating. By the way, Citizens plans to make some moves to shrink its coverage and the risk to taxpayers. A panel of executives will give some recommendations to the governor and the cabinet coming up next week to put the brakes on growth with roughly 1.5 million policyholders. The state backed insurer is easily the largest property insurer in our state. Governor Scott and top Republican lawmakers are fearing the insurer would suffer massive losses if a big hurricane does hit. Unlike private companies, Citizens does have the power to place a surcharge on nearly every insurance bill if the state cannot cover such losses.